allow me to inspire you. This is Scotty Z and I am cruising in Lake Placid, Cairns. Just drove past this house. Look at the front medium strip. This is supposed to be like a walkway of this guy's house. It's all a fruit garden, fruit and veggies. Look, this whole thing, all green veggies. This one's a uh, cucumber. Uh, tomatoes at the back. There's pawpaw behind there. Climbing vine. Look at all this. You can eat this. Look, this guy's been picking it and eating it. Oh my God, this is awesome. What's he got over here? A different type of green that he's put decoratively around this palm tree. Some lemongrass up the side there. Look, it's the car park. Oh, look at this side. Eggplant. Look at these nice eggplant coming along. Ooh, hello. Eggplant. Uh, bananas at the back. Bananas there. I see pawpaw over here. Look at this. Looking out over the your yard. You could have a yard like this, right? With just your green little thing that you got to mow. You got to do something with it anyway. But this fella here, he's just a worker by the looks of it. This fella here has turned his front medium strip into an inspiration. You know, it's still a little dry, needs some work, but it's coming along. You know, it's coming along. This guy, whoever this guy is, he's friggin' awesome. That is so cool. Imagine if all of our streets look like this. See, the, you can see the guy down the back there. He's mowing his front yard. He's got to go out and do it anyway. It's Sunday today. He's out there mowing his yard. This bloke will probably come out when it gets a bit cooler and start working in his veggie garden. Nice. There's so much food here. I can't get over how much food it is. Again, it's a bit of a, it's a, bit of a rough uh, veggie garden. He may have just started getting into it or something. It needs some mulch. It needs a little bit more love. Um, cover the, the open soil a bit would be good. But at the end of the day, this fella has planted a veggie garden in his front yard for the whole world to see. I don't even know what he's got beyond the fence or in the backyard. That would be exciting to see as well. But how easy is this? Imagine a world where everywhere you went there was food. Food everywhere, not non-native trees and grass that comes from Africa that you've got to mow every bloody week or, or every second week. You know, an actual a, a, a garden all around us, the Garden of Eden that we cruise around and we, and we pick food and we share food and we're constantly connected with the earth. Now that is a world that I want to live in. All right, I'm going to go have a look at the rest of this veggie garden. But what an amazing concept, what an amazing idea. Oh, look, more pawpaw. Hello, pawpaw. Yeah, what a great, yeah, he's got pawpaw strip all the way along. So he's going to have pawpaw to cover this whole fence. Yeah, papa, pawpaw is papaya, sorry. Got a couple of potted ones there too. This is a citrus, I don't know, lemon or a, a lime or something. Nice citrus right in the guts of it. Yeah, it's fantastic. Some bromeliads, more pawpaw. He's liking his pawpaw, it's great. Some herbs, uh, what do we call that one? I can't remember. Anyway, yeah, just an inspiration, absolute inspiration. I love gardening and I love out there gardening so that people can see it and we can inspire others to do the same thing. Have fun, Scotty Z. I'm getting the hell out of here. Enjoy your Sunday. Enjoy your gardening. Cheers. Whew. Bloody inspiration.